This map has been a headache and a half. Let me tell you that much. Let me kill this turret in frustration. You deserved it. Anyway, this is what I believe to be lab underscore level three. Now, you may be a little bit confused and surprised to hear that name if you are savvy in the uh, nomenclature of these old Portal Prospect era maps. Because lab underscore level 3a is the final map to this era of development. It is a map that we actually have the original version to. So, what is going on here? And to that end, I can't really give you a proper answer. Uh, allow me to elaborate to the best of my extent. Um, inside the source files for this chamber, chamber 16, if you are to look at a number of different uh, entities, they have the nomenclature of Lab 3, which means this map was either named Lab underscore Level 3, which would fit with the nomenclature of the escape map, Lab underscore Level 3A, as well as um, Chamber 18, Lab underscore Level 4, or maybe this map was called something like Intro underscore Lab 3. And we don't have any maps with that kind of nomenclature, so I elected not to uh, name it something like that. Anyway, um, allow me to explain some of the work that went into making this map. I'm a little bit tired because I already recorded this, but um, the recording corrupted and broke itself a little bit, and I decided it would be better to just make a new recording than, you know, to uh, repeat that and upload a broken file. So, to elaborate on this map, this is taken from lab underscore level 3a, this um, door prefab. However, the screenshot that exists of this map, it is a screenshot for over there, also uses the same um, looking things. Let me kill these turrets really quick, and I can show the exact area that I am referring to. This room was completely by interpretation. I just needed something to fit back here and give the play confused. And I thought having another little um, empty uh, office room would work. This office over here, this is taken from um, lab underscore level 3a and is modified to fit the screenshot. And this section over here in its entirety is shown off in the screenshot I'm mentioning. So, let me explain how I came about recreating the shape of this map. And we can do that by seeing these smudges on the walls here. And there are a couple back here, uh, somewhere on this wall, though it's hard to see. This right here, and a number of others. There are a total of seven unused visual groups in this map's file um, that contain nothing except for some decals with the nomenclature stating that they are uh, decals surrounding um, displacements. And I elected not to put in said displacements. They probably would have been like broken out bits of wall or dirt, concrete, dust, whatever. I elected not to make them just because I had no idea what they would look like. However, I did um, model the map based off of where these uh, decals were, as well as the screenshot for this section right here. Uh, I do think this could have possibly been part of the escape sequence, and the reason why I say that, other than because of the name, is because these are office doors. You see them in lab underscore level 3a. However, I don't think there are any uh, other maps that use these office type doors. They all use, you know, no doors and then these types of windows with the spikes in them. So I feel like 
this could imply that you are in the behind the scenes areas, and it was recycled as Chamber 16 in the final game. Obviously, I can only tell you what I think is a uh, reason behind the nomenclature and the bizarre naming of the map. But, uh, you know, my theory is as good as anyone's. The best I can do is uh, interpret and recreate. And that's what I'm doing. Uh, we're way past um, the length of the previous recording, which means it's going to take forever to upload. But uh, last recording, like I said, it got corrupted for some reason. If this one does too, I'm going to scream and probably break something. Anyway, the last part that I added in was a uh, level transition. Let me kill these guys so I can talk a little bit more clearly. A level transition that leads into lab underscore level 3a. Um, I do need to add a new cube map in here because it looks a little bit wonky right now. As you can see, cube maps and dark spaces don't really get along very well. And also I haven't compiled uh, lab underscore level 3a yet, so... The uh, transition doesn't actually work. It will once I finally compile the uh, final map, but, you know, tomato tomato. In either case, I believe that is everything that is to be said about this recreation. It took me a ridiculously long amount of time to make. This is by far the most advanced chamber I've recreated, and lab underscore level 4 was a long one, and uh, the one that I uploaded yesterday, whichever map that was, chamber 10, that was a long one, so if you'd like to see more stuff like this, obviously uh, voice any opinions or comments, questions or concerns in the uh, comment section, and I'll try to get back to you. If we could also start trying to get some of these videos out a little bit, uh, it, it, it would help me a lot to uh, get some support with these past just uh, the amount of people who already watch my videos anyway, so... Feel free to share these videos around, and um, as always, I believe that sums things up, so if you'd like to see more things like this, feel free to subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video, whenever that may be. Thank you all for watching, my name is Wolf Clock, and I'll see you guys around. Ciao!